hello and welcome in this video i will demonstrate how to add conditions in the print management setup as an example uh, just assume that you have a you have different set of invoice format and you want to have some condition based on the condition those invoice format will be sent to the different different customer or customer group or based on the condition or you want to have a condition that for some set of customers or for certain set of groups that the email should go to a particular email box so how to configure this print management setup uh, based on the condition so let's see we will go to account receivable just an example so these conditions are available in any print management you can you can use this you know methodology to configure the condition based print management setup in any print management uh, form so right now I, I will demonstrate in the account receivable part form setup and free text invoice so i will just go to print management under account receivable and then free text invoice so once you have this free text invoice and if you expand it you will have this original right so here we just configure the print management so for you see for all the custom based, based on this business current setup all the customer will receive the email whatever is available in the contact id but as i mentioned i can have or we can have conditions in the print management so right for now for that you just click on right click on this and click on new so it will create another one so right like this one like I mean like this way I have created two conditions under the original and here I have given a name like group 10 and here I just selected the condition so suppose I have selected if you click condi condition select and then you can define the conditions here okay so once you have defined so for 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 one condition I have given group 10 my customer group 10 for another condition I have given group 20 so what I mentioned that for group 20 all the email should go to this email ID with this report format and for group 10 all the email should go to this email ID with the different invoice format if you see this is a different invoice format and for for all other customers which is not falling under this condition it will use this default it means if it is not group 10 or group 20 the system will send all the email to the customer email address which is having as business with this report format so this is the condition based print management configuration let's see the demo so before going to the demo i will just go to the customer master so what i will do so this customer 12 10 what we have done for customer 12 10 there will be a set of uh, I mean if any invoice is generated it will go to a particular email id and for customer group uh, 20 it will go to a particular email id ramitpaul417 gmail.com for 10 it will go to ramitpaul2 at that outlook.com and except this other than these two group if we use any customer like this one if i use so it will basically send the email to this email address whatever is available in the customer master right so this is the scenario and also you remember we have defined the different invoice format as well so that also you can leverage so let's see if i go to free text invoice so what i will do i will create three invoice in this demo and i will showcase how this works so for customer 12 it is group 10 Say I'll select anything like this, adjust this. I'll click on post. So print invoice, use print management destination. Click OK. So hoping this will send the email to my Outlook ID. So let's wait. This is the old one okay let's see if you see this invoice has come and this is the subject i have i have given in the uh, you know you know print management setup 
for your information from 10 to 39 this subject also we can give in the print management setup previously it was not there just for your information so this one their team the invoice is raised for internal services this is the intercompany one i have defined that anything which is customer group 10 it should go to the it should send the email to this email box this is done now we will check another scenario which is uh, say let's go to the customer i think this is the one control so europe which is which is customer group 90 which is not falling under 10 or 20 so ideally it should go to the email id which is available in the customer master i will just click on post click on so print management yes use print management destination to okay Let's wait. So the email has been sent. Quickly, we will jump into the customer master from here, and you will see the contact in contos so at the top vendor uh, consolidated messenger.com. So for this, I don't have this email ID. So what I can do, I can just go to my send box from where this email is going. Okay. Let's see the same box. <clears throat> okay. If you see, the email has been sent to this email ID from my email box. So, dear customer, thank you for your trust on us. Here is the final invoice for us. So, this is the invoice ID and the format we have defined in the print management for as a default one. Now, what is rest? The rest is group 20. So, for group 20, it should send the email to the to my gmail id so if i go to group 20 i think okay let's do one thing let's go to the customer master ones find out the exact one so this one is a group 20 so doesn't matter which email id it is there because anyway all the email should go to that uh, you know ramit dot ramit paul other Ramit Paul 417gmail.com, right? So let's see. Create new. I don't know. Okay. Why I'm creating customer? I don't know. Uh, my bad. I will create free text invoice. Select any account. Just for raising this invoice if i click post click post print print invoice it using print management destination let's see so this is also done so i will just check this so basically this is the invoice has been sent now so please find the attached invoice so it, it has been sent to this email id so basically the two and from is same so that is the reason it is showing under to me the same email id but if you see the writing is different and the format is set as per the print management destination okay so for your information i would also I would like to touch base how i have configured this subject uh, for different different subject for different different group so if i go to free text invoice so for original if i go here in the printer setup if you see here i have added this subject so this is the new feature which has come on 2239 so you can write that subject now previously it was not there similarly for group 10 i have given a different subject a male body i'm sorry it was not subject only it was a male body so this is a different male body and if i go to a different condition group 20 so this is the another male body and subject okay so that's how we can configure the uh, print management setup based on the conditions and also 
uh, you know very common scenario you will fa you will get in any implementation or any organization that organization can have different different format for different different group or the segment of the customer so using this functionality condition based print management setup you can configure like this for group 10 i have con i have selected this report format for group 20 i have selected this report format with a different email whatever is required based on that you can configure so that's how it works the print management setup can be con configured based on the conditions what you want to have okay so that's it for this demo hope you have liked it you will be able to implement it or you will be able to leverage this functionality in your uh, assignments thanks for watching bye for now